A major thing that a lot of fans are very curious and excited to see on the big screen is exactly how both J.J. Abrams and Chris Terrier will use unused footage from both The Force Awakens and The Last Jedi in order to give Leia a very important moment and or role in Star Wars Episode Nine. This is Mike Zero here. If you guys are new to the channel, do make sure to subscribe to see future Star Wars content. Now, that's the thing here, the fact that Carrie Fisher will be involved in, in Episode 9, even after her death, by use of unused footage, I think is incredible. Uh, this idea was absolutely done by JJ and Carrie's family, her brother mainly, and that, I think, is a very good thing for the Star Wars franchise, and in order to really respect Carrie Fisher and just honor her by really inserting her into the final Skywalker Saga film. Now, these past couple of weeks or so, we've been learning a whole lot more about this film when it comes to some of the set leaks, the set designs, the concept art and storyboard descriptions, etc. Now, one of which has all to do with details of a scene that involves both Leia and, of course, Kylo Ren slash Ben Solo, indicating that we could very well be getting a reunion between these two characters. Now, a description of Leia inside of her Resistance base that is very similar to the one in The Last Jedi. There is fire everywhere and falling embers from the ceiling. A rear shot of Leia shows one of the blast doors pierced by the First Order with bright light shining through. In the distance in front of Leia is a silhouette figure of Kylo Ren standing in front of the entrance to the base. The figure walks close to Leia as the light fades away from Kylo's face. Now, both Leia and Ben are face to face for the first time in years. The dialogue of choice is described as Ben delivering a line indicating he is willing to help his mother. So, the thing that really does pique my interest a lot here is how it goes over one of the shots of Leia inside of a Resistance base that is very similar to the one on Crate in The Last Jedi. Now this to me sounds like they're going to be reusing the footage that we saw at the very end of Episode 8 where she's actually talking to Luke Skywalker for the very first time in many many years. I think what they're going to do is they're, the, they're going to use that footage essentially and mix it with new footage including Adam Driver as Kylo Ren interacting with Carrie Fisher slash General Leia. Somehow, some way, I don't know how, dialogue will be exchanged between these two if it does make it to the final cut of the movie, and if they are able to make it work, because this is a very hard task for Disney and Lucasfilm. I don't know if you guys knew, but it is a very hard task to pull off in order to really make this seamless between a character that is actually being used from past films where the actor or actress is no longer alive and also by having them interact with a character that is being portrayed by another actor in a current film. So it's a very hard task to complete. I'm not quite sure how dialogue will be used. My guess is that if they really want to pull this off and get it right, they could have Leia in a moment of silence actually witnessing her son for the very first time, where then perhaps, let's say for example, Kylo Ren delivers a line, let me just think of something off the top of my head here, let's say if he says something like, I'm gonna get you out of here, because apparently one of the pieces of dialogue of choice here indicates that he's gonna help his mother. So what if he says, I'm gonna get you out of here, or let's get you out of here, and let's say, they use a shot of Carrie Fisher just saying yes or let's go or something like that and it just cuts away. Maybe it will be a very short reunion where a lot of dialogue won't be exchanged like how it was in The Last Jedi between both Luke and Leia. Again, I don't know how they're going to really make it work. They could always do rear shots more so of a different actress portraying Carrie Fisher as General Leia. They could do that if they really wanted to. But as you all know, they're not recasting the character, they're not going to do any CGI work on the character, they're not manipulating the character in any way, shape, or form, that is not Carrie Fisher. However, I think that supplementing the shots, the sequence, if you will, uh, by inserting other extras, playing a look-alike of Leia, at least from different angles, I think is the way to go, in order to kind of give you more possibilities and different angles in order to make the scene a little bit more tangible, right? 
So episode 9 I think has a lot to deliver when it comes to more reunions. We do know that Lando Calrissian is coming back into play here. Uh, Leia is back. Luke is back. A lot of things are happening. And there's also a lot at stake here for our characters, you know. Uh, whether Leia, Lando is going to die or Chewbacca or the droids, we have no clue. And if they do have the confidence to do that, you know, I really do uh, hope that they're ready for a lot of people to really get very angry if it's not done in the right way and just for the sake of it you know so anyways guys drop a comment below let me know what you think about all of this in the comments and if you guys did enjoy the content for today do make sure to drop a thumbs up on this video to support the channel i thank you also very much for the kind support and i'll catch you guys next time